know, dirt track's an unusual sport. It's, it's, there's not a science to it. There's a lot of arts. We're here in lovely Bergdorf, Switzerland at our advanced engine design center, Polaris Swiss Auto. And behind me is the amazing Scout FTR 750cc race only dirt track motor. It's really great working with our team at Swiss Auto. Uh, they're really passionate motorcyclists. They have got a great motorcycle history. They've got a great motorcycle racing history. So when we first talked to them about designing a brand new flat track motor, they were excited. I mean, who wouldn't be to design an all new ground up race motor? From, from day one when we founded the company, oh, that was a, racing was a big part of, of the story. And, uh, we, we really like the competition. Already in the third year of the existing of the company, we were in Formula One. No? And, uh, and uh, one year or two years later, we started with the motorcycle racing engine. The nicest part was uh, that, we, that we really could build the first Indian racing engine in 60 years. So what the honor or, and what, what an exciting uh, part of the history of Indian. So it runs, it, it has, it's, it's, uh, all the specific data are even better than expected, but now we have to go into the development on the track and on the dyno to, to make it step by step competitive. I think the idea of making dirt track important at factory level may push the affair over the top. I would like to see that. I would like to see what aftermarket King Tom Seymour said to me at Sacramento, which was, you know, Indians coming in here big and the others will have to follow. So this is a really exciting phase. We have a running heart, you know, we have a running motor and we're gonna take this great piece that the Swiss Auto team has given us and build an amazing chassis to go out and hit dirt track that as we get professional level riders on it, we can go out, we can test, we can learn, we can quickly adjust and continue to make improvements and make improvements and make improvements until we're competitive. And once we get the bike competitive, we're gonna hit the track.